Hey everybody, it's Bill. Um, I'm back. I have the starter painted now. And I'm going a little further on doing stuff. Um, as you can see, the Chrysler 225 Marine uh, Steger is on. And it's on on this side. And it went on better than I expected it to for... Yeah. Oh, sorry about that. I've been putting together the uh, hoses... Um, I still have this one left here because I have to get into there on the uh, alternator when I run the wiring harness up here. I've got my wire loom up there, if you remember, that we picked up the other day. And I've got my wiring harness right here. Um, so, you can kind of see it. Let me see. I'll grab it so it sticks out a little bit better. i got my wiring harness here, uh, the harness, and the actual mounting plate for... Uh, the relays and the regulator um, then uh, I think I told you the other day I had put the new hoses on um, I put the the fitting for the the warning gauge that would correspond to this one here um, I put that in and I'm going to work on starting to get the wiring uh, loomed up like it should be um, so I can lay it down inside this area here and start running it up to the to the alternator. So I will be back in a bit. All right, let's try this again because evidently someone's texting me in the middle of while I'm trying to do this. Um, I was working on doing the wire loom there for the leads. I have a couple other things to sort out on that. Um, painted the mounts. The mounts got to dry. So um, I'll be putting on... The next time, let me turn this light on for us. I'll be putting on where that big black bolt is, the uh, connector that's that's similar to the one for the throttle cable for the shift cable, and then we'll be tightening down the starter, and we'll be starting to mount the uh, wiring harness on there. And with the light on, you can see that other switch I was pointing at the other day, uh, the pressure switch for the alarm warning to go with this one here. Anyway, that's it for now. Um, I'll uh, talk to you guys later. Goodbye.